day in Singapore and it's actually the last day before we fly out to Malaysia and come back to Singapore a month later. We decided to spend our last day in Singapore at Sentosa Island. We took Uber from Geylang, our area where the hotel is. Took us about 20 minutes, cost $20. And there's so much to do on this island. It's the center, it's a hub for entertainment. There's Universal Studios, there's aquarium, kids water park, cable cars, beach, bunch and bunch of things to do. We decided to start with going to Siloso Beach. And there are two options to get there, either taking a cable car, and it would cost us $13 from top to get to the bottom where the beach is, or take a nature walk through the forest. So we decided to take the Imbia Trail and walk through a very humid and sweaty rainforest. Rainforest. <laughs> and I'm chewing a gum. I feel like the only place where I can chew a gum. Outlaw. Is somewhere deep in the forest. Outlaw. So that I don't get a fine of thousand dollars. Ooh, look at this bug. <laughs> So we just walked the whole loop for about 20 minutes, sweated our asses off, and we got exactly to where we started. So now we're giving it another shot, and hopefully we're gonna get to the beach. Great job. Covered in sweat. We made it to the beach. The view is definitely more industrial than enjoyable. Lots of big boats. Not giving a relaxing uh, vibe. Celosa Beach disappointed us a little. It's still a beach. There's still water and sand, but considering that we're flying off to Malaysia tomorrow, this is just a very tiny teaser of what's to come. But if you're here in Singapore and you want to put your feet in the water and sand, and this is your only chance to see the beach, I guess that's a good option for you. There's not much to do. It's poopy. I don't know what else to say. Me done. Right? Just sucks. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. I'm talking to a dead cat. Hello. Let's get ourselves a cable car. This is my kind of car with the space for Starbucks. The ride took about seven minutes and that took us from the top of the hill down. We were at Siloso Point. And now we're at uh, Merline Siloso and that costs $13 a person. Nice ride. 13 bucks.
in Sentosa and the Maryland behind me is considered to be the largest and the tallest statue in Singapore. There are actually five Marylines spread throughout the city. The one behind me represents the Prosperity. He's the Prosperity Guardian for Sentosa Island. You have an option of going up to the head of the Maryland and it costs $12 a person to see the view from the Maryland onto the city. It might be the largest and the tallest Maryland but it's still a copycat. The real thing is in Marina Bay, and in our opinion, it's nicer and cleaner. And now we're gonna take this cute, colorful train back to the city. Thank you for visiting Sentosa. This train is bound for Sentosa Station.